guys. Uh, today I'm just thinking about to share how I use the Microsoft OneNote today. So uh, let's uh, have a very brief idea how I use it. Okay, so uh, in your phone, no matter Android or uh, iPhone, you can open the. Uh, you have a Microsoft OneNote, and uh, after you open it, you can see the notebook so here, and uh, using this icon add okay so just press it you can uh, open any any new book, notebook here okay the concept just like uh, you have any individual physical notebook there so every subject i recommend you every subject say open one just like me uh, you i have an economics anger something that so after in the in the notebook actually you can uh, open many new sections uh, for me i uh, using the topics into different sections okay here just press it on that and then you have a new session just put it in the uh, for example, basic economic concepts. Okay, then you can uh, open a new one. Uh, actually, using here, you just uh, slide into left, and then you can easily to delete it. Okay, so uh, when you actually, you can still change the colors here. Okay, so actually many many things you can try, but the most important in the in every sections in every topics you can have for for the pages here for the pages. So in the pages we, we can put the, the notes exercise or some reference or my refraction there or my personal notes here. Okay, so what I do, I try to input every uh, exercise or the learning guide in uh, you know in our lessons. Okay, so uh, actually I can uh, import some. PDF here. I put an an exercise tempo on two here, and uh, how I do that actually very simple. I just press on the any empty space. You have this editing keyboard. You can roll it to the to the right, and then you can find you can find the icon, the attachment. So from the attachment, you can easily to to browse your Google. Actually, you can browse many drive. Google Drive, iCloud, like OneDrive. Even on your iPhone, in an Android phone, you you can also go to the same location. So let's go to Gujarat. And uh, for me, economics, materials. Okay, any 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 PDF here. Okay, so just in case I import my PDF here, then I press it. Actually, it's only an icon, but I will press it and slide uh, uh, slide to the right hand side. Then you can see that it's a print now. Just then you can see the whole the content of the PDF now okay um, actually you cannot type anything on that because this is just like an image but uh, the most magical thing is I can draw okay so here under top right hand corner I have very drawing tools okay so I can use in the pen using the highlight pens for example using highlight pen then uh, I would like to highlight something, for example, or oh, research or selling price, something like that. I use a highlight pen to do this. Actually, when I do this, when I watch it in my, on my iPad or on computer, I can have the same, same thing. Okay. So here, let's talk about the PDF. Or uh, if you, we have an exercise or notes, we can do this like this. And actually, because recently we have many videos. Okay. So actually, I can, uh, I can uh, search or watch videos on the uh, online on YouTube, no matter where. Then I can make uh, my own notes or my handwriting. So I take a picture to keep my handwriting here. Then I can uh, write some notes about a reflection or some questions I would, I'm not very clear, I want to ask later. So I can write some notes here, blah, 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 blah. Okay, so it's very nice. But uh, how, I, how, I, how I do this, is it very convenient or very uh, complicated? No, actually not. If you go to um, YouTube, YouTube here, then you just try to um go to any video for example this old just like uh, A B C D A B C D Okay we well, just skip this Okay then actually um you we, you can find the share button here then actually you can share to one note you can see this share to one note then um, you can just write the title of this, okay, is it ABC song or ABC learning videos, okay, whatever. Okay, uh, I learned in the Elfress. Then I have this and a location I would like to put uh, under, oh, sorry, ABC. Then uh, here I can, so I can put the location, that means which notebook I would like to say uh, English. 
then this is maybe the um, vocabulary I put on the vocabulary and then ABC then I can say just press send okay so go back to the one oct okay now because I put it in English so you can see put English vocabulary I have their notes here okay I have YouTube so after you watch it you have something to like okay um it's very nice or I have uh, some several key points I can use the several format to make it okay um it's uh, uh, ABC then uh, DDF that's what I learned and uh, the song is nice uh, okay it's a four keys it's fun okay something like that I can plus on something and like even I can take pictures here so for example here you can see uh, a camera icon so I take pictures from my library or take a new picture here okay um, I take pictures okay this is maybe this is my handwriting notes or in any screen I, I can see in, on the street then I have over here and uh, even I can uh, record my voice here recording recording I am handsome I am handsome okay so then it's yes, a uh, rel related uh, audio so if uh, you, you don't want to type so much uh, at the very, very short time you can record your audios and then go home and then uh, organize it later so it's very convenient so uh, every time when you when you do more uh, actually there's many many other functions you can try by yourself actually formatting the things I'm putting the link here okay so um, that's why I, I recommend you use it and the most important you can use it in other device with one account login or sign in in one account then every device have the same things and also it support it support handwriting that's very convenient handwriting I can draw anything here I can highlight the things here okay or erase something or I just uh, like this okay so you can try it by yourself